We're living in an age of both a rhapsodic excitement about the power of technology as well as a kind of anxiety and fear about losing control over our tools. People fear AI while simultaneously marvel at the possibility that we might engender non-biological minds, that we might create sentience that is not bound by our biological limits. We fear the Terminator scenario, yet we marvel at the godlike possibilities we see in ourselves in the back of these technologies. Kevin Kelly, the founder of Wired Magazine, famously referred to technology as the seventh kingdom of life. He calls it the technium and how it's subject to the same evolutionary forces as biological evolution. Technological evolution has been born out of biological evolution, yet it persists with this move towards greater complexity and organization somehow, right? In fact, some cognitive philosophers speculate that the mind, the human mind as it exists today, is not just bound to the brain, but rather emerges in the feedback loops between brains, tools, and environments. We are distributed cognition. We are distributed intelligence. We are a hybrid of biological and non-biological intelligence. And so when we refer to things like artificial intelligence and technology, we make a mistake in assuming that we are somehow separate from these tools, right? It's all allowed by the laws of physics. It's all made of atoms. Therefore, it's all made of nature, right? We, if anything, are the cutting edge of the evolutionary process. We are evolution finally waking up, becoming aware of itself and starting to self-modify, right? We are for the cosmos to know itself and in knowing itself it can improve itself and this recursive self-improvement right will inevitably lead us to the stars right this is our destiny let us get to it let us move beyond all previous limits let us make this happen embrace technology embrace the future embrace what's possible my friends let us not fear what is happening let us steer what is happening. The singularity is near. Humans will transcend biology. Don't be afraid.